Okay, YouTubers, T Square here with T Square Talk. Round one of the free silver giveaway is over. Uh, some people have been eliminated and some people are moving on to round two. So let's take a minute and we'll see how the game went and then we'll check the paperwork and see who stands where. Okay, so there we have it. The game has just officially ended. Um, the final score of the game was 9-3. to three. Um, The Indians did win. Uh, it was a great game for those of you that did watch it. Um, for those of you that didn't, you can catch it online if you're interested in it. Um, but now let's see who stands where. Okay, so right here we can see that everybody that was in the white... They had a two next to their name originally. Those were all the people that had the Indians. Um, before I go on and show ev where everybody's standing, where everybody is now, um, and then we'll look at round two, how we're going to set up round two. Um, we did have two, uh, some people that, first we had some people that had uh, put comments in to recheck the names and maybe that I missed them. Um, we went back and explained everything out to the individuals two of them was legit mistakes that was my fault um so what we decided to do the first one was mercedes um her name was not on the original form but she did leave a comment and it was on the video so what i did was i tagged that comment and moved it to the very top so if anybody has any questions about that they can go and see the comment was in and we just missed it so she did get put in um, now. It's round two. Um, she did have a little bit of an edge for getting jumping in round two. I mean, but we we had to do something to make it right. Um, the other one was Mike G Pro. Um, he had done a shout out and uh, it we missed it. Um, so what we decided to do with him was also give him an entry. Also because. She, she would Mercedes would need someone to play anyway, so that was why we decided to do the shout out, put him there. He only gets one entry for the shout out, but it's a guaranteed entry into round two. Everybody that did a shout out has moved into round two, which we expected would have happened. Um, because there was no way at a 50 50 odds you're not going to flip a coin and get five in a row. Um, and the computer dropped everybody on different colors. So, with that being said. Let's see who is where. Now, the way this is set up now, all the blue have been eliminated. They were all, the, the blue was rooting for the Twins. The white was rooting for the Indians. That was what the one and the two was for on the first page. Um, on the, I'm sorry, on the last page, as you can see. So, one was blue, Twins. Two was white, Indians. And it was all computer placed. So... Now what we have set up is basically all the players that were in white are moving on to round two. So what we did was we reestablished numbering system. One, two, one, two, one, two, all the way through. What that means is of those four players, of, of them, now there's only two that will move on. Either Silver Hippie or Silver Sam will get their name moved over here depending on which one wins in round two so those two are playing against each other now i'm going to go through all of them so you can see if your name is still on it um, and who you're playing against now right here um actually i should have gone to page one first let me jump over to page one real quick i'm gonna pause this Okay, the reason I wanted to jump to page one is because there is an odd amount of names on each page, so people might not fully understand. I mean, it's the same thing. I'm going to comb through all the pages so everybody can see, but D-Wings World is playing NY Silver Stackers. Those two will be against. There's a one and a two. One of them will move on over here. Um, so we'll comb through all the names real quick. And this is page one. So if anybody has any questions, they can actually refer the page number two. Now, right here, as you can see, they're not playing anybody. There was not another name to pair them up against. So what happened with them, that name 
got moved to the next page to pair up with the other person on the second page that didn't have anybody to play against. You see what I'm saying? Just so everybody know, understands it. And I'm also going to put a link. Um, it probably won't be instantaneously. Um, but I will put a link in the bottom in the description. So you can refer back to any of the videos if you have any questions. Um, but I will be following the comments in this video. So if you have any issues, leave a comment in this video. Um, I will monitor it. As you can see, Sam got moved over to play here just to keep the teams even yep. we haven't decided the game yet that we're going to use today we're going to do that with random.org pick the game and pick who has what And like I said um, before, everybody that did a shout out, they had uh, five entries. They for sure, everybody moved into the, the next round, which I expected. And now if you are paired up against yourself, which I didn't think it happened, but at this point it can. Um, none of the names will be moved. They'll just keep getting condensed. And there it is. And right here, round two. So we will pick out how we're going to do round two in just a second here. Okay, so round two. We're going to come over here to the computer. And we're just going to see what games we got going on tomorrow. So tomorrow is Sunday. And there is a list of all the games that we will be that will be going on. And I'm just gonna write right here. Sunday, June eighteenth. Put a one here. And we'll put a two there. So as you can see, now we're going to write in once we figure out the game. Okay, so to figure out the game, there's going to be 17 games tomorrow. 17 games tomorrow? I'm sorry, 15 games tomorrow. As you can see, you can count them out too if you want. There's eight and seven. So that's 15. We're going to jump over here to random.org. We are going to generate, and just like in the original, there's one, two, three, all the way down to eight, and then nine, all the way down to 15. So to pick out the game, we'll come here, one to 15, generated a game. Number five, so the fifth game that was on the first row. So let's just see here what we got. We got one, two, three, four, five. That is the Padres and the Brewers. Okay, now the question is who's going to be, who's going to have the Padres and who's going to have the Brewers? So to decide that, we're going to come over here to random.org. I already have it set up a, another window. One and two. So. Let's see who it is. The Padres and the Brewers. Okay, so the Padres will go on whatever number gets generated here between 1 and 2. So the Padres are number 1. Okay, so the Padres will be number 1. So then we'll come over here. And I will write in the Padres right here. Sorry, there's a little space there. I'm, I'm writing through a camera. 
and the Brewers will be over here. Okay, so, so everybody understands. The Padres are all the number ones. The Brewers are all the number twos. That game will happen at 110. So it'll happen about the same time tomorrow. Um, we'll go through one more time. And you can see where you stand, who you're rooting for. Like I said, ones are Padres, twos are Brewers. So when you look right here, there's the one, there's the two, two, one, two, one, the whole way up through. Now looking at this real quick... I just want to see something because I just happened to notice this. Now, right here, you see how Ed is playing here. So those two, one of those two names will move over. One of these two names will move over. Now, looking at this now, Ed has the Brewers on both of them. If the Brewers happen to win, Ed will have to play himself in the next round. He will knock his own, one of his entries out. That's just the way the computer generated it so but we're going to go through we're going to see uh, everybody can check their numbers on what they got one last time and like i said i really hope y'all enjoy this style of giveaway it's something different um it keeps us all interested i don't mind doing it i i really like big giveaways that's why i'm such a big fan of march madness um because there's so many games in such a little time. Um, if you are still subscribed, come March Madness. We've got some plans for a really big giveaway. Could be like probably one of the biggest giveaways. Um, I've never seen YouTubers with like a lot of people do any kind of difficult giveaway. Um, and this, this one will be pretty big. <laughs> um, you'll have to just wait and see um, if you're interested. We do like doing giveaways. I don't do this for the money. I just do this YouTube because I enjoy it. Um, anything I make off YouTube, I just kick back. Now, I mean, if I ever get super big, like, you know, PewDiePie or someone making 50 million, I don't know if I can get back 50 million. That would be a big giveaway. But then again, man, if you could do a giveaway, giving away even a million, that would be pretty amazing. I'm sure everybody would want to join then. This is super exciting. I, like I said, I can't say enough. I really hope you all are having fun. And that was it. That's the end of it. So, with that being said, um, we got the game set up. We know what game it is. It will be tomorrow. Um, the sheet will all be retyped up. Um, the names will stay in the same spots. There will not be a round three on Monday. Round three will probably be on Tuesday. Um, that will give me a day to retype everything up and condense it. And good luck to the Padres. Good luck to the Brewers and good luck to everybody. Leave a comment in here. Let me know what you think of this giveaway. If you think this is uh, enjoyable, let me know. So I know you guys enjoyed it. If you don't enjoy it, let me know. You know, that way if you want, I'll go back to the regular org drawing, um, random.org. Um, and just let me know if you enjoy it. And also root for your own team. You guys have a great one. Hope to see you again on T-Square Talk. Take care, guys.